you, everyone. Okay, settle. Okay. I'd like to welcome you all to this debate on Iraq, whether it was justified or just for oil. I'm keen to get started, so let me introduce Millie Fairfax, who will be speaking against the House, but more importantly, Corporal McClintock, who shall be speaking for the House. Hey, uh. You all right? Um, uh, my notes. Uh, um, okay, so this House believes that the Iraq conflict is a lot like macaroni because, on its own, it's it's um, dry and horrible, a bit like Iraq. But it's it's when you add the cheese sauce that that's when it works. Eh? That's when it comes together. That's that's when you love it. But if you add a cheese sauce that does not work, that's where you get the problems. Like I remember once my dad was experimenting like with a new cheese sauce and he used dairy wee, um, and that didn't work. Actually, it made him woke. Corporal, are you being serious? I know. Looking back on it, it's total madness. But at the time, you know, he was just he was just experimenting. He just was trying to make a sauce that works. And in a way, looking back, like us in Iraq, we were maybe, you know, that new sauce. And perhaps some of you think, you know, that we, the army, were dearly, or maybe you think we were cheddar. But the bottom line is we were just trying to make a better sauce of it. Millie, your response? Well... Talking of sauce, take the sexed-up dossier. You wouldn't have had to try and make a better sauce if the government's recipe had been accurate in the first place. What? I mean that if the dossier represented a recipe, then we, the nation, were given the wrong recipe. We were misled on how to make macaroni cheese. Ah, but see, I don't think there is, like, one right way of making macaroni. Uh, my mum makes it with a blue cheese sauce. Well, that's disgusting. I mean, you should be making it with a yellow sauce, eh? Like, a yellow cheese, cheddar, you know. Nanny used to make it with a mix of milder, creamier cheeses. Well, you see, it's complicated. Like, when we were in Iraq, you know, we were trying to make a new sauce and we maybe didn't have all the ingredients, but we were on a budget, you know? It was a bit like Ready, Steady, Cook. We did the best we could with a bag that we got, you know? to you that far from being on a budget a la ready steady cook you were effectively shopping from Marks and Spencers you were dropping organic cream cakes on defenseless little shoppers I, but what were we supposed to do we invited Saddam Rune for dinner but he didn't want to eat with us I mean we try to cook for him maybe you didn't try hard enough in fact I put it to you that you offered him steak and he was vegan there were no real options you bought the steak, you knew he wouldn't come round, let alone eat it. Well, Millie, sometimes it's difficult to cook for vegans, especially macaroni cheese. 